So this is the notorious haunted red room at Borthwick Castle in Scotland. Um, as you can see, there's a, there's a four post bed there. Um, it is quite red, actually. It does live up, very much live up to its name. Uh, so this is the um, this is the red room uh, at Borthwick Castle. I'm, I'm I'm now sitting on on the the four post bed here. Um, nothing, 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 nothing happens. I feel a bit like uh, you know those documentaries that the BBC used to do where they used to send celebrities like uh, Ross Kemp or Joanna Lumley somewhere, make them live in a tent where they had to, you know, just do a video diary all night and listen out for bears or wolves. Uh, it's kind of like that. It's a bit like that. I'm I'm here uh, listening out for bears and wolves, and um, there there aren't any in here. Uh, uh, what there is, though, is um, let me just show you this. There is uh, uh, supposedly right this on the uh, on that that there. What you're looking at there is the mysterious shape of a woman's head that appeared after the after a, a maid, a pregnant chambermaid, was killed in this room with a sword. Um, not re not this morning or anything. No, it was sort of in the you know, sort of 1400s or something, but, um, and then mysteriously that bit of cement, modern looking cement in the shape of a woman formed just after. Right, what the hell is that? By all accounts, uh, the things that are happening here include scraping at the bottom of the door in the middle of the night, um, people feeling their legs being pulled literally that not like a joke not a joke analogy that's like an actual leg being pulled in the middle of the night um wailing noises on the stairs uh footsteps walking past the room on the stairs which kind of isn't surprising as the stairs sort of lead to other people's bedrooms so i suppose that's that makes sense um but uh but a lot of weird activity in here and so i'm hoping that if anything do weird does happen then I, I wake up in the middle of the night and something's pulling if, a, if an entity is pulling on my foot at any point, I'm, I'm hoping that rather than leg it, what I'll do is bother to switch this camera back on, film my leg being pulled, and just so you can see it, and then then you know, then leg it, providing it hasn't pulled my leg off. That's the that's what I'm hoping. So it's now a little bit um, a little bit later on, and. Uh, um, odd noises so far. It's a bit. It's a bit like that. I don't know if you caught that program, um, "Ghost Hunting with Girls Allowed." There was genuinely. I'm not making that up. There was genuinely a program called "Ghost Hunting with Girls Allowed," right? And I, I, I I'll admit that I, that I wish that girls allowed are in here now with me. Um, because it'd be a very different sort of night, wouldn't it? Um, I don't wish all of them were here. Obviously, just the just there's just a couple of them, probably, um, possibly Cheryl. Um, you know, because she's notoriously violent. So if a ghost turned up, then um, she'd probably kick its face in um, and be ghostist towards it. So uh, that'd be that'd be all right. But um, but it'd be it'd be nice if you know if some if someone else was here. I think I think it'd be it'd be better. Um, it is quite odd being on your own in what is notoriously a, a haunted room. Um, even though it's nonsense, I, you just find yourself looking around quite a lot. I wish I wish girls allowed us here. So, um, middle, middle of the night report, uh, no, nothing's, nothing's happened as yet, there's been, there's been some, some sort of strange noises um, coming from uh, sort of where the wardrobe is over, over, over there, and uh, n nothing, I mean you can, 
it's you know it's quite it is quite eerie. It's uh, it's kind of an eerie atmosphere to the place in here, knowing that you're the only. I don't, don't know whether you heard that. Sort of noise from the stairs. Um, probably just the stairs. Uh, hey, let me just let me just turn the music off for a minute. Yeah, actually, that's uh, to be honest, that's a lot less spooky now. That's um, yeah, that's much better. And I'll uh, I'll see you in the morning.